the back pressure causes the upper part of the stomach to pop into the chest. It's called hiatal hernia. They're usually small. They're associated with gastroesophageal reflux, heartburn-like symptoms. Sometimes they're quite big. Sometimes almost the entire stomach can be in the chest. It's called the intrathoracic stomach. The chronic inflammation from the gastric acidity, which you're not used to having above the diaphragm, can induce a change in the epithelial lining of the esophagus hyphen stomach there, and it's called Barrett's esophagus. And that's inflammation, and this leads to a type of cancer called adenocarcinoma of the esophagus. It used to be squamous cell with smoker drinker cancer. Nowadays, we see more adenocarcinomas, different type of cancer in this area from the gastro chronic gastroesophageal reflux, usually abbreviated GERD, gastroesophageal reflux disease. And you know, way, the way Western medicine thinks, it doesn't say anything about diet. It just says, oh, take this pill, like a proton pump inhibitor or something. And then when you start blocking the acid in the stomach, you create new problems. Now you get more bacteria from the food, survive, get into the small bowel, you can get SIBO. 